Hello everyone. Today I'm going to teach you how to fix your Microsoft Store not downloading apps or games. I'm using Windows 10, but this will work all the same with Windows 11. The first thing you'll want to do is check your C drive storage. Usually one of the problems when it comes to downloading anything is that your storage for your computer is full, therefore it will not allow you to download it. To check, you'll click on your file explorer, find this PC and click on it, and then you'll check your OS C or it might say local disk C. Make sure you have plenty of free space. If you don't, that's okay. I'll show you how to empty some of it. Right click your Windows button and hit settings. Go to your system settings and you'll find storage. Click storage and it'll start loading up all files that are taking up storage currently on your PC. Once everything loads, you're going to want to click temporary files. As you see, mine is taking up 59 gigabytes. It will then scan for all files that fall under the temporary files category, such as your recycling bin, your downloads, and a few other things. I recommend clicking your recycling bin, as everything in your recycling bin will be cleared. I'd be careful when checking your downloads folder, because that will remove everything that is in your downloads folder. Make sure you check your downloads folder for anything that you want to keep. Then hit remove files. Once that's finished, you can close your settings. You're going to go to your search bar and type in CMD. You're going to find command prompt, right click it and click run as an administrator. Hit yes. Inside of this black screen, you are going to type in a command. That command's going to be wsreset.exe. This will reset your Microsoft Store and reopen it. You can now try to re-download an app or game that you were trying to download before. If you still can't, that's okay. Close your Microsoft Store, we're going to type in another command. This command is sfc space slash scan now. It'll begin a system scan and this can take some time, so for the time, minimize the command prompt window. Go to your Windows search bar and type in services. Open up services. Inside of this window, we need to find something called the Windows Update Properties. Click anywhere and press the W key. This will bring you down to the W section, since everything is alphabetical. Find Windows Update Properties, or just Windows Update. Double click it and it will open up this window. You're going to set your startup type to automatic. If it's running, click stop and then hit start. Then hit apply and OK. Then we need to find Microsoft Store install service. So click anywhere on one of these again and press M. This will take you to the M section. Now you, what you will do is find Microsoft Store install service. Double click on that and it will open up the window. Press startup type to automatic. If it's running click stop. Then click start. Click apply and then click OK. You can now close the services window. Go to your Windows search and type in store. Right click your Microsoft store and click app settings. You're going to scroll down until you find terminate. You're going to click terminate. After you click terminate, you will click repair and wait for that to load. This is just going to clear the cache of your Windows store. After it's done repairing, you're going to click reset and wait for that to finish. Now that it's finished, you can close the settings. Now you are going to restart your computer and try to download an app or game again. If that doesn't work, that's okay. What you're going to do is go to your Windows search and type in PowerShell. What we are going to do is reinstall our Windows Store. Right click Windows PowerShell and click Run as Administrator and click Yes when the option appears. Inside of this blue screen, we are going to type in a command that is in the link in the description. Go to the link in the description and grab the first one that you see. Use Control C on your keyboard and Control V to paste it. Then press Enter. Then you will take the second command from the link in the description and paste it as well and press Enter. That has re-downloaded your Microsoft Store. You can feel free to close the PowerShell window and restart your computer again. After it's restarted, you can open up your Windows Store and you should be able to download any app or game that you would like. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and we'll see you in the next video. Bye.